Well, going from the title of winner to loser usually isn't a person's goal, but for Ruben Stutter, the road to weight loss will be a major milestone. The key facts for you this morning. Starting this week, Birmingham native Ruben Stutter will compete on the biggest loser. The new season kicks off on Tuesday, and this year's theme is second chances. Here's a look at what we can expect from Ruben this season. The number on the shirt represents the weight that I'm at. Never weighed this much before. Weight woes for Birmingham's hometown hero. I've been a big guy all my life. You know, I've, I've um, well, I guess from the time I was in the fourth grade until now, and um, I've always had to deal with it, but I dealt with it well. And, you know, I um, was always comfortable in my own skin and never really had any health issues. And, you know, uh, I got older and, you know, uh, high blood pressure snuck up on me and, you know, got here and, you know, the doctors told me I was borderline diabetic. And this is just, you know, it's just, it's an eye opener. It's been 10 years since Ruben Studdard first stole the hearts of Americans on the world stage, winning American Idol. You go all the way. Now he's vying for a new title. Hi, I'm Ruben Studdard. I'm from Birmingham, Alabama, and I'm going to be the next biggest loser. Running. You want it. Repetition. Weight loss the, the right guy. way. So working Everyone for results. It's got to be something for me to learn how to come here and get a lifestyle change and not just, you know, the quick fix that, you know, gets the quick weight off so that I can look good for an album cover, you know, that I can look good, you know, for a television show I'm doing. I need to be, you know, at my optimal health for the rest of my life. You got diabetes. Since winning Idol, Ruben says music has been the driving force of his life, his health, his weight took a back seat. I guess, you know, part of the problem too in the South is that we cook so much great food, but it's so bad for you, you know what I mean? And, you know, for me coming to this process, you know, really retraining myself as to what the good things are, I could take that back to my family and, you know, show them love in different ways, like show them, you know, a healthier way to cook for each other so that we can all be around for a long time. Ruben has worked out before, but never Go to work on this level. Oh, please, this somebody. time around, no recording studio, no phones. My cell phones, Lord. My TV, my DVR, everything to kind of fix my mind on a goal and fix my mind on getting myself healthy. The only communication is the situation at hand, losing weight. I have been used to coaches fussing and hollering and, you know, doing whatever it takes to motivate you to get, you know, yourself to a point where you could be at your best. And, um, you know, it was nothing different. It's just that this place is so high strung, like the whole situation, like, you know, from the walking up to the to the gym, everything is just such a, uh, it's, it's a lot. And it's, and it's even, it's compounded, you know, uh, more because you're away from everything. I am afraid. It won't be a walk in the park. You know that you can get through this. But when Ruben is finished, this journey will mark a new chapter of healthy living. <laughs> Ashley Roberts, Biggest Alabama's 13 News. Chance at life. And the Biggest Loser season 15 premieres Tuesday at 7 p.m. Central. We have created a hashtag, by the way, if you'd like to show support for Ruben on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Here's the hashtag for you. You see it there on your screen, root for Ruben, using the number four, not the word. Again, hashtag root for Ruben. Definitely wish him good luck.